In this morning's video, I want to talk a little bit about gold. Now, we've been watching gold. We saw gold yesterday uh, while we were uh, trading that it's been doing quite well. If we look out at the daily chart of gold, you can see that the market uh, had quite a bit of a rally yesterday and the day before we had kind of a nice uptrend. Again, we had another repeat of that again today. So we've had some quite a bit of volatility in the gold market. So if we come down to the range bar six chart, you can see on the very small time frame down here, the pre-market time frame, the London market was very active, making nice, beautiful trends. And so we saw that come into the morning session. And then of course, 930 is right at about the time, 9.30 Eastern time, that the U.S. market starts heating up. That's when the stock market opens. Of course, this being gold, uh, very much affected by that. And then you can see that we had a nice, beautiful counter trend come in here on this nice uh, pullback, only for the next rally to come into play. So if we come in here, and let's say we got in at the blue light entry spot, the first exit would have been a $360 move. If we'd have gone to the arrow, that would have been about a $580 move. First thing there in the morning, in gold. So that's just a quick wrap up of what we saw in gold this morning. The very best times to trade are those morning sessions. Always look back previous to the the opening of our time frame, see if London is making nice beautiful trends, see if the trend has begun over there, and then look for our signals, wait for the our timing over here in the US market for that counter trend to come in. Use that as our entry point for the trend. Now we're trend traders, so that means we want to get in with the trend. We use the counter trend to help us enter on the trend. The number one question I get when people watch my videos is they want to know what software platform I'm using and what indicators I'm using. First and foremost, if you come to our website, TradeMentors.com, you'll notice that we have a section here called Tools for Traders. If you click on Tools for Traders, the software tools in here are listed. And you can see the recommended trading tools. We have the live trading platforms that we use. These are from Track and Trade, Track and Trade Live Futures, and Track and Trade Forex. If you click these more info buttons, you can find out more information about the platforms we're using. I also use a plug-in to the live futures version that is called the Bulls and Bears. That's the Bulls and Bears is what turns the price bars red, yellow, and green and gives me the Elliott Wave uh, blue light system. And so that's a plug-in into the live version of Track and Trade. And it works on both uh, the live futures as well as the live Forex. Now some research tools that we love and that we have here listed as well are the Trade Miner tools. This is Trade Miner for stocks, futures, and forex. This is one of the research tools that helps us identify the fundamental nature of markets. And then of course we have News Miner. News Miner is the current active uh, information, scours the internet, tells you what the current news is on any given stock, future, or forex, and then ranks them which ones or which markets are in play. So again, if you want to have a little bit of information about the tools that we use here at Trade Mentors, come to our website, www.tradementors.com, and click on the Tools for Traders button.